Hi guys, it's me Malcolm, the movie Wizard of Oz himself, and I'm here to discuss my review of the fifth entry, I mean, my review of the fifth entry of Bring It On that I should have done a long time ago. My bad, sorry for the wait. Bring It On, Fight to the Finish, starring Christina Milian. Boy, what are the odds that she will be doing a teen movie considering of you know, her age. But then again, other I did recall other actors who were very older for who were old who are very older for for their age playing teenagers in movies. Like for example Yeah, you get my yeah, you get what I'm selling. selling. So this is talks about about Christina Milian as as Lena, who lives in East LA, but she has to move to Malibu because her mother dated a rich white man, man, and she became a fish out of water. I must say, the movie has the same plot points as. As the third movie, Bring It On, All or Nothing. And not only she's in it, but also we get to see Holland Roden. You might know her as Livia Martin from Teen Wolf, the band she are. I love her. <sighs> she was amazing in this movie. But I did despise that nasty cheerleader, the captain of the Jaguars, Avery. Oh. I'm a bitch, I'm a boss, I'm a bitch and a boss, I'm a shine like glass, I'm a bitch, I'm a boss. Oh, she was such a bitch. She was so awful. She was one of those villains or bullies you love to hate. Oh, if, I were a, if I were a girl, I would have giving her a good punch in the face. I'll, I'm honest. I'm telling you the truth. But I... So... So, in order to do that, Lena... Lena took the liberty of being the new captain of the Malibu Sea Lions. And where they have to battle battle Avery and her Jaguars for the Spirit Championship. And I must say, I really do love it. And I really did love the choreography of this. It was awesome. I really love the music they choose. I mean, so far they got music by by Christina Milian herself. a song song in the end of the movie there's Cap de Luna for her Spanish version of Wind Up the Veronicas and of course one of my very favorite pop artists Lady Gaga but it's all right, I'm all right, just Oh. oh, I can't believe she they used one of the song one of her songs in this movie. It is awesome. And not and we also get to see a cameo of this Latina pop duo Prima J. They have their own song in this one as well. I wonder what they're doing right now. Either way. So, I really did love it how it ended. i really amazed how, how Lena and her team won. And, and how the Jaguars lost. <laughs> Especially when Avery was crying. Crying like that. Oh, it was crazy. It was crazy. 
but a little bit cringe, though. In a, you know, when Lena told, Lena asked, asked Avery if they should kiss and make up, uh, Avery's response was, cat bite me. But in a way, I do imagine them kissing, kissing makeup anyway. Too bad. They would have been such good friends. Mm. So for my score for this movie, I think I'll give this one just a 8.5. I really like it, but I don't think it's that, I really think it's not really that a big successor successor to its fourth predecessor. I still think Bring It On and To Win It is still one of my favorites. <music> Hands down. So if you like this video, like, comment, subscribe, and be sure you all stay safe, stay healthy, and wear a mask. Oh, and bye.